The human body is a complex system of interrelated organs, which must work together to function properly. The endocrine glands control the body's functions through chemical substances called hormones, which are released into the general circulation. The hormones act as chemical messengers, traveling through the bloodstream to various parts of the body. The organs of the endocrine system are located in widely separated parts of the body. The pituitary gland is in the cranial cavity. The thyroid gland is in the neck. The thymus is in the thoracic cavity. The adrenal glands and pancreas are in the abdominal cavity. And the ovaries and testes are in the pelvic region. The hormones they release regulate basic drives and emotions, such as sexual urges, violence, anger, fear, joy, and sorrow. They also promote growth and sexual identity, control body temperature, and assist in the repair of broken tissue, and help to generate energy. The pituitary gland is a small pea-sized gland located at the base of your brain. It is controlled by the hypothalamus, to which it is attached. The pituitary gland is sometimes called the master gland, because the hormones it releases serve to coordinate the functions of the nervous system and the endocrine system. In addition to producing hormones to regulate the other endocrine glands, the pituitary gland also produces hormones that regulate water retention by the kidneys. Another causes the uterus to contract during childbirth and then stimulates the production of milk in the mammary glands. One of the most important pituitary hormones is a growth hormone, which also works with insulin to control the level of your blood sugar. Insulin is a hormone produced by the pancreas. The pancreas lies just behind the lower part of the stomach. It is the second largest organ in your body. The pancreas also produces the hormone glucagon. Insulin and glucagon work as a check and balance system. If too little insulin is secreted in the body, an excess of glucose develops, a characteristic of diabetes mellitus, the most common disorder of the endocrine system. The thyroid gland is located in the neck and secretes two hormones. One hormone affects the growth rate and metabolism of all of your body's cells. It controls reflexes and regulates the rate at which your body produces energy and transforms food into body components. The other hormone decreases the amount of calcium in the blood. The small parathyroid glands embedded in the back of the thyroid gland produce a hormone that works closely with the thyroid hormones to help maintain homeostasis of blood calcium, thus preventing a harmful excess of calcium in the blood called hypersemia from developing. Overlying the heart is the thymus, a twin-lobed organ consisting largely of developing lymphocytes. Lymph circulating through your body carries white blood cells to this organ, where they multiply and transform into special infection-fighting cells. Although the function of the thymus is not fully understood, it is known that it plays an important part in developing immunities against various diseases. The adrenal glands curve over the top of each kidney. They secrete the hormones which help the body reduce stress. When the sympathetic nervous system reacts to intense emotions, such as fright or anger, large amounts of the hormone are released. This causes a fight or flight reaction, in which blood pressure rises, the pupils widen, and blood is shunted to the most vital organs and to the skeletal muscles. The heartbeat is also stimulated. The adrenal glands also secrete the hormones that are energy generators, regulating the metabolism of carbohydrates, fats, and proteins. Another hormone regulates the mineral and water balance of the body. It prevents excessive loss of water through the kidneys and maintains the balance between sodium and potassium in the bloodstream. This balance is important to the contractility of muscles.